for me. I'm a technophobe. Uh, new gadgets and gizmos, they scare me a lot. Um, and it's not just big things like computers taking over the world. And that. So it's the little things. One of my housemates just bought a toaster, right? Gets better. Um, <laughs> this toaster can toast four pieces, right? Four pieces, yeah, yeah. Wait for it at once. You know, I've never had to toast four pieces. If I do, you know, now the option's there. The thing is, the way technology is going soon, it's going to be six and it's going to be eight. And I don't know when it's going to stop. As a technophobe, that fucking petrifies me, you know? I mean, if my iPod gets any smaller, I'm going to inhale the fucker, huh? You know, if my internet got any f faster, I'd have nothing to do at work all day, you know? I'd probably end up leaving work early or get hit by some new car because it's so fucking fast and quiet. I should die, but new medicine will save me. Spend the rest of my days getting around some rocket powered wheelchair being tended to by some robotic nurse. Eh? He's probably got five fat little robot kids who want a piece of toast for breakfast every morning. <laughs> I, think it's, I don't think it's going to stop there. You know, I'm going to get a bit older. I have a couple of kids of my own. They'll say, Dad, you can't tell these jokes about robots. I go to school with robots. Some of my best friends are robots. <laughs> you know, my daughter will be harassing me to send money off to some rusty little robot on the other side of Jupiter. Then one day my son will come home with a robot. I'll say things I didn't mean. He'll accuse me of being robophobic. <laughs> uh, a few months later, just to show there's no hard feelings, I'll attend their civil ceremony, only to embarrass everyone at the reception by doing the fucking robot dance. <laughs>